Kingston upon Hull. It's a bustling city that's on the rise. Taking a walk around the city centre, you can stroll down any of the streets and find yourself a fancy new cap at the local Woolworths. Or maybe just a new pair of seeing spectacles. Where its name originated, there is great debate. Many historians have said that King Edward named the city the King's Town, but many locals believe it's due to its great ties to Eddie Grant and his deep love for pop reggae music, naming it after Kingston, Jamaica. Maybe we'll never know. In 1642, it was said famously that Sir John Hotham had denied King Charles I entry into Hull, but it turned out the King had said he didn't want to go there anyway, and he wasn't bothered. Maybe some of the beautiful parks and gardens may take your fancy. A stroll with your sweetheart. Maybe a picnic. Or maybe just shouting profanities at the local minorities. The possibilities are endless. And here's where Hull really shines. The fishing. Locals say there's more fish in the port of Hull than all of the world's oceans combined. This seems very unlikely, but is yet to be disproven. What separates Hull's fishing trade from the rest of the world is its workers. Half man, half haddock, giving them a keener understanding into how fish really think. This has proven to be vital to their industry. So the next time you're playing a holiday, why not try Hull? Because it's not shit anymore.